so here we're shown this uh, shaded rectangle and uh, we are shown these two lines that go through this point 0.42 um, and we're also given this point is A, A0. This is A0. Questions, what's the area of the shaded rectangle in terms of A? So I need to find its dimensions somehow and um, what I can do is I can find the equations of these lines because the first one that goes through the origin, its slope will be 2 minus 0 over 4 minus 0, which is half. So the equation here is y equal to half x. And uh, that means that this point here, which has the x-coordinate of a, y value would be a over 2. So we know that this is a over 2. Next, I need to find that length. So can I find uh, this point, which is has the same y-coordinate of that as that point? So if I can find the equation of that line, which I know these two points, so I'll start with slope, 2 minus 0, 4 minus 8, or 2 over minus 4, or minus half is the slope. So the equation is minus half x plus b. To find b, I know it goes through 8, 0, which means y is 0, when x is 8, which means b is 4. So I know this full equation of this line, which is minus half x plus 4. Now I'm looking for the x-coordinate here, when the y coordinate is a over 2. So I can replace a with, sorry, with y with a over 2 and find the corresponding x coordinate. So I'm actually going to move this guy here so that it's positive. I multiply both sides by 2, so that becomes 8 minus a. So the x coordinate here is 8 minus a, or in other words, this is 8 minus a, which means that this distance is the difference between 8 minus a and a, which is 8 minus 2a, which means the area is a over 2 times 8 minus 2a. If I distribute this, because all the terms are expanded out, it's 4a uh, minus a square. And that is answer choice C. Maybe there's other easier way to do this problem, but this is kind of what came first to me. Of course, in the exam, you don't have too many options to try several different approaches, so you just have to pick one and stick to it. Maybe there is an easier way to do it, uh, but for now, this is kind of how I approached it. So the answer is C.